the 2019 full year, they've got they played a lot of cricket there. Yeah. They played almost 35 youth internationals before that. So, so with Uttar Pradesh, so one thing I'm cricket border with Jeta Jeta Pabu Jeta, I mean, other guys are there. They don't know about Jeta. See, but Sherukh and Kuno, I mean, but Uttar Pradesh, India, club is there. World Cup, we are board there. 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 तो फाइनल टाइम का टारगेट नहीं हमने बॉल का बजा ची तो शेखर ने हमने इधर फुलफिल करते हुए ची बोले इधर एक टा सेटिस्फाइड हमने और सपोर्ट अब देखे जिधर बोल रहे थे साउंड तक तक देखे जिधर बांग्लादेश की कट मतलब की के रजन नो पेशन अनेक बेशी और बांग्लादेश जाए तो शाब्दिक में जिधर कुम सपोर्ट करे so I think to answer your question number one uh, uh, within the last two years uh, the work that the boys have been doing and they have been scoring the 2019 full year they've got they played a lot of cricket there they played almost 25 youth internationals before that so so when the World Cup uh, stage came in the players had Lots of experience behind them, and it was very clear as a team for us to, you know, which role which person can play. So uh, when we came into the quarterfinals and semifinals, uh, we had a very specific plan, and the ground that uh, we played in Potter's Room. Uh, if you look at the conditions, uh, the side batting first, uh, if you get 240, 50 runs. It's a very good score that we got. So we always had that plan in mind. If we had to bat first, uh, if we lose the toss or bat first, then we are looking at scoring something like that. So uh, I think that's the reason. If not, if you are playing uh, in at home, we are always looking for a bigger score, like you know, close to 300, things like that. So, so because of that, it was drilled to the players that you know we don't need to get that one. If you get cushion number one uh, uh, within the last two years. Uh, the work that the boys have been doing and they have been scoring the 2019 full year they've got they played a lot of cricket there they played almost 25 youth internationals before that so so when the world cup uh, stage came in the players had, had lots of experience behind them and it was very clear as a team for us to you know which role which person can play so uh, when we came into the quarter finals and semi finals uh, we had a very specific plan the ground that uh, we played in Potter's Strom. Uh, if you look at the conditions, uh, the side batting first, uh, if you get 240, 50 runs, it's a very good score that we got. So we always had that plan in mind. If we, if we had to bat first, uh, if we lose the toss or bat first, then we are looking at scoring something like that. So uh, I think that's the reason. If not, if you're playing uh, in at home, we are always looking for a bigger score, like you know, close to 300, things like that. So, so because of that, it was really to the players that you know, you don't need to get that one. If you get 250, you can win a game with a bowling plan. So, so because of that, uh, all the players were playing their specific roles. So there was uh, planning up to the last. Uh, thing, so that's why. Were the captains not and in in general? How uh, like yeah, I think Akba is the uh, the least uh, top player up to the World Cup final. If you, if you look at the services that he has done uh, within the last two years, it's unbelievable. He's, uh, he's coming to a situation where when things, are, things are hard for us because he bats at number seven. And most of the time when we went to New Zealand and in England and the series against Sri Lanka, I don't think he batted uh, in any of the games. Most of our top water batsmen scored lots of runs, so he never got a chance to bat. So we had to shuffle the batting orders in order to make the, the number six and number seven boys to go and have a hit in the middle. And uh, 
he always knew that uh, he had that temperament and he had that confidence to go and finish a game. And uh, he's one of the best players that I have seen uh, under pressure, keeping his head cool and, uh, and very calm in the middle. As long as he's in the middle, then uh, we have confidence back in the dressing room. And 40, 50 rounds, it's a very good score that we got. So we always had that plan in mind. If he, if he had to bat first, uh, if he lose the toss or bat first, then we are looking at scoring something like that. So uh, and that's the reason. If not, if you're playing uh, in at home, we are always looking for a bigger score, like you know, close to 300 and things like that. So, so because of that, it was really to the players that you know, you don't need to get that one. If you get 250, you can win a game with a bowling plan. So, so because of that, uh, all the players were playing as specific roles. So there was. Uh, yeah, I think Kakba is the uh, the least uh, top player up to the World Cup final. If you, if you look at the services that he has done uh, within the last two years, it's unbelievable. He's, uh, he's coming to a situation where when things are, things are hard for us because he bats at number seven. Most of the time, when we went to New Zealand and in England and the series against Sri Lanka, I don't think he better uh, in any of the games because most of our top order batsmen scored lots of runs. So he never got a chance to bat. So we had to shuffle the batting orders in order to make uh, the number six and number seven boys to go and have a hit in the middle. And uh, he always knew that uh, he had that temperament and he had that confidence to go and finish a game. Uh, he's one of the best players that I have seen uh, under pressure, keeping his head cool and, uh, and very calm in the middle. As long as he's in the middle, then uh, we have confidence back in the dressing room that uh, he handles the situation well. Captain, I want to thank you for the First of all, congratulations. <coughs> Obviously, 